Hello everyone, RushX here, and today I'm here to introduce you to a new series called Osu Players Spotlight. This series revolves around showcasing some of the more niche and underrated players and plays out there. It's being managed by our newest staff member, Spaza17, who is bringing it over from his personal YouTube channel. This is a bit of an experiment, so in this episode we'll have commentary for each play, but that most likely won't be the case in the future. I hope you enjoy! Although this map is extremely short, AE Frog Dog's score is certainly still unique for its requirements in terms of aim control and precision since it's CS 9.1 with flashlight. Sorewa Chisana Hikari no Yuna is a short map with few HDHRDT full combos on it. Not only did he make this AR11 score stand out by adding flashlight, he also SS'd the map, outshining everyone else on the leaderboards. With the only other HDHR DTFC to be seen on this map having an accuracy of 97%, this full mod double S on Stay Alive definitely deserves a spot. Don't let the star rating fool you. Even though it's only 2.27 stars, this score is not as easy as it looks. This difficulty of Narcissus at Oasis, a loved map, is entirely made of sliders with different shapes that become harder and harder to follow with flashlight. It's also very easy to drop slider ends at any point, but AE Frog Dog still manages to SS. Getting into another AR11 flashlight score by AE Frog Dog, this time it's on a map that's full of HDDT full combos without a single HDHRDT score to be seen on the leaderboards, which is why this full mod double S is all the more impressive. Let's go. 
Love Distance Love Affair is a map with more than 1,000 combo, where first place on the leaderboards was originally claimed by Bachigo, another player who SS'd it with Hidden Hard Rock Flashlight. This did not stop AE Frog Dog from trying to beat it, however, and that's exactly what he did with his Hidden Nightcore Flashlight FC. Anyone who's ever played Osu Standard certainly knows about Masterpiece. This map has become extremely popular within the community, namely for its difficult squares section. Mesita's full combo with Hidden Flashlight had remained untouched for nearly 6 years and was considered unbeatable. However, AE Frog Dog took it one step further and FC'd it with Hidden, Hard Rock, and Flashlight, making this a truly memorable first place. Pika Girl is another insanely popular map that has actually seen quite a bit of competition with Flashlight throughout the years. There are many plays with Flashlight from players like Adam Kuz, Foreseen, Azerair, and Pudi Game, so getting the number one score with HDHRFL was not an easy feat. Playing a 5 minute long map with flashlight is obviously really difficult as is, and it becomes even harder if you're trying to hold a double S. Combine that with AR 10.8 and you get this score. This FC on Kimi no Hitomi ni is a testament to AE Frog Dog's skills with flashlight, accuracy, and nerve control. If you've ever heard of AE Frog Dog, you most likely know about his score on Living Things. If memorizing a 35 minute long marathon map is a peculiar task, adding Hard Rock and Nightcore to the equation is simply insanity. With 23 minutes and more than 5,000 combo, this play undoubtedly deserves the spotlight. It's 